Hello guys, I am continuing the coverage of this amazing sublime tool LM Deploy. I already have done a couple of videos yesterday and today where I have shown you how to get it installed, how you can use it to serve a large language model on multiple GPUs and I have also shown you how you can quantize a model no matter if it is a text model or a vision model easily with this LM Deploy locally. In this video, I am going to show you how you can do inference very quickly with the vision language models locally. When we say vision language model, in a single line what it means is that the model is capable of describing the image or talking to the image. Vision language models or VLMs in short are AI models that combine machine vision and semantic processing techniques to understand the relationship within and between objects in images. These models use computer vision and natural language processing or NLP capabilities to understand and generate text about images, bridging the gap between visual information and natural language descriptions. There are a lot of use cases of vision language and there are a lot of types. For example, we have some of them for image captioning. Uh, these are the ones which generate description for images and that is what we are going to see today locally with one of the models. And then uh, you can also do VQA which is visual question answering about images. You can do image text matching. You can do content creation where you can generate engaging content for marketing, advertising and storytelling, role playing. Or you could, you could do multimodal understanding. And you could also use them for virtual and augmented reality, healthcare and the list goes on and on. But for the purpose of this video what I am going to do I'm going to first show you how to install LM Deploy again and then we will install a vision language model and then we will use that vision language model to describe an image. So that is what we are going to do locally. So for the purpose of this video, I'm going to use a virtual machine which would have Ubuntu and then a GPU card from NVIDIA. Both of these have been very graciously and generously sponsored by our good friends at Mast Compute. If you are looking to rent a GPU on affordable prices with no lock-in contract with a very very flexible terms and conditions which are very very few by the way I would highly recommend you to go with Mast Compute. Both of my VM which I am going to show you now and my GPU are both sponsored by these uh, good people so really huge shout out um, to them. This is my VM where let me quickly show you which VM I am running so it is Ubuntu 2020.04 and if I do the SMI command this is my NVIDIA RTX A6000 courtesy to mass compute. Let me clear my screen. Also make sure that you have Conda installed which keeps everything simple and separate from your local installation. Let me um, so if you are look this is of course you are doing first time. I would suggest you create a conda environment for LM deploy. Let me show you the command. This is the command um, to create the conda environment. I already have it, so I'm not going to do it again. I'm just going to activate that conda environment. That is the next step after you install it. So I'm just going to do conda activate LM deploy, and you will see that it is now in parentheses. Let me clear the screen. Now, if you have CUDA version. 12, then you can uh, then the installation instructions are a bit different for CUDA less than 12 they are different so let me show you what is my CUDA version as you can see my CUDA version is 11.5 so which is less than 12 if it shows you 12 for you all you need to do to install LM deploy is this pip install LM deploy and that's about it but because I don't have that so let me show you what I need to do first I need to specify the exact version of LM deploy which I'm going to use which is 0.4.2 in this case and then I need to install this LM deploy from the source like from this command and this is present in their github repo which you can check out if you don't can't find it let me know and I'll, I'll be happy to give it to you you see that is all done let me clear the screen now let me fire up my python interpreter and then we are going to download the model and then install it the uh, first actually show let me quickly show you the model which i am going to use for this purpose 
So this is a model mini intern VL chat to be two billion parameter one, which I'm going to use it. I already have covered it out, uh, on my channel in detail. If you want to know more, you can go to their hugging face page. It is quite a fine model, a small model, but packs a lot of power in it. And it is in this model card, they have given a lot of details that it's a multimodal model. It has 2.2 billion parameters. And then they have shared the training strategy and a lot of stuff. So you can check it out. Uh, or if you like, you can just search with it on my channel and you should be able to find it. Let's go back to my terminal. Let's import some of the libraries from LM Deploy, such as LM Deploy itself and also load image because we will be using an image and we will be using our model plus LM Deploy to talk with it. Okay, so that is done. Now let's download our model. Download uh, Downloading the model with LM Deploy is very simple. Just pipe in. I'm just giving the GitHub uh, Hugging Face repo uh, URL or repo name to that pipe and then you see it has downloaded it it's slightly go above downloaded it and it has given it to us you can ignore this flash attention one it doesn't matter for this one okay now next up let's load our image and again the good thing is that we are just going to use the same uh, load image library from lm deploy itself if you go above you see that we already have imported this from here and we don't have to use below or any other library to separately load and use our image so that is done let me first show you what that image looks like and then we will go from there so this is the image of a tiger with a green grass and that sort of stuff and i'm going to ask that model and lm deploy what exactly is happening in this image okay so let me quickly load the image image is loaded and then i am piping that to model that is done very very quick that is another beauty of this and then now let's print out the response here you go so it says the image features a majestic tiger lying on a grassy field the tiger is pre prominently displayed with its body stretched out on the grass its front paws resting on the ground its fur is a rich orange with distinctive black stripes and then it is also telling us that the lighting in the image suggests it was taken during the daytime with natural sunlight casting soft shadows on the grass and if you look at this image again you would appreciate yes there are soft shadows how good is that beautiful beautiful model I always have loved this model uh, other than lm deploy but you see that lm deploy has made it so easy to use this and that is the beauty of lm deploy now another thing you can do it you can as i mentioned earlier you can very easily serve this through uh, your own multiple gpus for that i will drop the link to that video in video description you can serve it from this server and you can access this uh, inference from uh, restful api through python curl or whatever you like so as you see amazing tool really you know very impressed by this tool try it out let me know what do you think if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel and if you're already subscribed then please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching